Hello everybody, welcome back to Firefighting Simulator The Squad. Happy Thursday to you, hopefully you're having a great week so far. They added a new update on October 20th, which includes a new mission, as you see right here, and also the NVIDIA DLSS. Uh, I have that enabled to the max it possibly can go. All right, remember we gotta go as uh, absolutely as fast as possible. Siren comes on. We're just gonna drive like a maniac so we can try to get this challenge complete of getting there fast so we're not going to be realistically driving code three here if a car pulls out in front of us it's their fault we'll just smash straight through them that's what we're going to do responding to the emergency call now it's good to see that we're getting some quality of life updates to this game albeit very slow and few and far in between each other but hey you know what a new mission i'm always down for it i do have a blast with this game looks like the stutters are still very prevalent here unfortunately that's not going to change uh we'll go to the inside view here so the fov was changed a little bit for the last time i played i don't know we got apex at corner there you go oh man i mean as much as i could apex it i suppose yes by the way for those of you that have been asking yes i will be uh back in action with american truck simulator and flight simulator that is happening there's so much going on i'll tell you what after moving, I am just done with building things. You know what I mean? Like after you move, well, the thing is, is I got two new rigs from Next Level Racing that had to be put together and they are a to-do, let me tell you. So um, that's what's been taking so long. And then I got sick in the middle of all of it, uh, but I miss it dearly. It's not going away anytime soon. Just wanted to let you know that. I see smoke. We'll get our AI to help us out today since we're playing single player. All right, I guess we have to make a turn here. Yep, they want us to cut through this way. Hey, that works. Where do we, where do you want us at? Oh, in there, in there, in the corral? Traffic accident, what? Because we drove, what is this? Well, we're gonna hit that, I guess. I guess we could have gone around to the right, but you know what, screw it. I'm gonna make things difficult because I can. There you go. Throw it in reverse, buddy. Parallel park this. And let's see if we get the bonus. Do we get the bonus? I don't know if we did. I don't know if we did. Did we get the bonus? Get out of the, get out. All right, here's the 360 check. So we can see it's a pretty involved fire here. I'm not gonna be using any fire terms because I am not a firefighter. Um, But yeah, that looks like some trees burning to me okay here we go we are out in the middle of nowhere i'm gonna have to hook up a supply line first so uh these guys are already starting that okay cool they're already on it hey dude move out of my way hey how about you move out of my way so i can get the supply line thank you very much there we go i'm gonna get that all right they got the attack lines going well we have to get a supply line first bud so let me go take care of that real fast all right right here's where we're gonna hook everything up and we don't need a hydrant tool or anything like that we can just take that off there and connect the line there hey pick that up buddy Time is uh, everything right now because there's a car and I don't know if there's any victims, but I have a feeling since it says search and rescue, there are going to be victims. I really do think that's going to be the case. That's the supply line. Take the cap off and connect it. All right, we have a supply now. Sweet. Let's get an attack line going. We cannot mess around any longer here. This is just taking way too long, dude. Uh, yeah, right there. And you can go into there. All right, now we got that. We're going to need more uh, nozzles. Okay, there we go. Awesome. Put that onto there. It's a whole to do. Let me tell you. All right. Yep. We got water. Sweet. Um, all right, dude. How about uh, you? You're going to actually, you know what? I'm going to have two get a get one of those and three you as well. All right. Number one is already on it. Yep. Put that down. Once they get their uh, hose, number three's got his hose. So I'm going to go three this way. There you go. I'm going to push this one here. And then we're gonna get number two over here as well. Two, you ready here? Right here, buddy. All right, cool. Let's start getting these fires out so we can push this thing back. Uh, I'm gonna go towards the car first because that's what I saw happening. Man, this is a heck of a blaze. Yeah, there's the car right there. You know what? Here, I'm gonna drop this down. I'm gonna start, since they're doing that, I'm gonna look and see if I can find anybody. Because search and rescue is still popped up. That might be my bad. Oh, there's a person over here. See, this is why we were checking. Can you hear me? You okay? They're unconscious, but seems okay. All right, let's get them down here. It's gonna be a minute. 
Look at the little obstacle course we have here for like, you know, for uh, bikes. Hey, hey, yeah, you, you do that. One. Yeah, get them. Thank you very much. He's going to do that. I was like, all right, man. Yeah, we're going to work together on this one because we have no other choice. Look at that guy working hard over there. Hopefully these are the only two victims and they were not in the fire. So that is good news for us. I must say. Yeah, we're going to get this big boy up before too long here. We'll see how it goes. All right. Victim is safe, boss. Victim safe. We got it. That was all the victims. Sweet. All right, back to our line. You, buddy, uh, you, you got to get onto that, dude. You have got to get onto that. No, 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 no. Don't follow me. Get your hose. Yeah, get your hose, man. Go get it. Don't steal mine. Don't you steal mine. Don't you steal mine. No. He stole my and give me my give me my are you kidding me get back yeah you need to make yourself useful hold on a second one we're gonna have you go get go get one yeah go get he just runs through the fire looking like idiot what are you doing dude i was hitting uh, the wrong button there so i thought i was dropping the tool didn't want to do that all right we have to quench all the fires now this is gonna be a lot and we're gonna get that uh i might have to big, get the big truck up here in a second once once this guy gets back up here, they're going to start attacking this line here. I'm going to try to get the uh, T-Rex up and running. That's what we're going to try to do next. All right, this is working, though. We're pushing it back. I wonder if we have to get up in the trees itself. You do. Look at that. Holy moly, man. Look at that. The trees themselves have to be put out. All right, is he good now? Yeah, he's spraying. All right, all right, cool. I'm going to drop this here real fast. Be right back. And just a jiffy. We need to get the outriggers out. Oh, yeah. We have a lot we need to do. Commander seat. Where's it? Yep. Here's the retract the outriggers. There they go. And we need a commander seat next. Once that's good to go. All right. I've been trying to get into the basket. But man, they just look at this. It will not let me into the basket no matter what I do. So we're going to go back to uh, back to the hard way. Boy, it would be really nice if we had a helicopter or something that could do some airdrops on this one, man. This is so much fire. It is just about crazy. You can see the guy on the left side, that AI, he's pushed up all the way over there. He's done a pretty good job of cutting a lot of that fire back. Let's just get this tree out if we can. I was really hoping to use the basket on the T-Rex, but man, I don't know why it will not. No matter what I do, I can't get in that basket. I've retracted it, done everything I could with that, but it's just not letting me. And I looked on Google. I looked in the, you know, the Steam discussions, which were pretty much useless. Um, nobody else seemed to really be talking about not being able to get into the basket. So I don't know what that's all about. It'd make our life a little easier, wouldn't it, to have that? But that's okay. I'm going to attack these trees for now. Getting the top of that tree right there. Yeah, that one was a little more harder to get, but I got to say... We're able to do it on, on foot. We will be able to do this. It's just going to take a lot longer, but that's okay. Some more longevity out of the game because one of my biggest pet peeves is that, man, the updates. I'm glad they're putting updates out and they're working on this game, but I really wish they would do like a mission pack or something because we need more missions to keep this game alive because once you get all the missions complete, you're pretty much done, you know? It's not like a... A sandbox mode or anything like that. I'm gonna have number three come over here. I think that's gonna be for the best. Yes, so he can help me off. grab this on out. That way we'll, we'll be able to get sections out at a time here. And maybe that's how we should do it. I'm gonna leave this that other guy over there on the left working, but what are you doing? Dude, he just walks right into the fire like an idiot. And he doesn't get the hey when he does it. If I go into the fire, it will. And getting those fires way up on the top of that tree, that is the difficult part of this whole one. But you can do it. You just got to find that sweet spot, you know. It is helping quite a bit. Let's get the trunk of the tree taken care of here. So once you get these trees taken care of, it pushes this fire pretty far back. And it's not spreading, so that's good. I went to a local treasure here in the St. Louis uh, area, and that is Eckert's Farm. They do... Uh, apple picking pumpkins all sorts of different produce but we went uh went for pumpkins and things like that um and had a good time and uh, i'll push you back this way there you go buddy there you go uh for those of you that don't know our wedding anniversary is on october 31st we uh we got married on a hall on halloween and we will be celebrating that but we actually that's what we did yesterday we celebrated that's why i took the day off 
to celebrate our uh, our anniversary. We did that. And we went out to, to dinner. And I got to say, if you are from the St. Louis area, you owe it to yourself to get a reservation and go to Annie Guns. Um, I hadn't, hadn't been there since I was a kid. And uh, it's just unbelievable food. Their food there is just absolutely ridiculously good. And for those of you that live in St. Louis, I'm sure you can... Uh, you can attest to that as well. So, highly recommend it if you haven't. Yeah, it'd be cool if we had this fire, like, kind of fighting back on us, you know? Right now, it just seems kind of just there, and we're just putting it out, um, rather than it kind of raging around and, and spreading. And, you know, that's one thing that I wish we could have is multiple fire units. Like, even having a brush truck uh, would be so helpful in this situation here. We need a brush truck and, and more rural... Uh, equipment would be nice or apparatus as uh, as they would say fast mission time expired dude yeah i wish i could get a fast mission time you guess what you won't let me in the basket of the dang uh t-rex that would have helped out tremendously so that's okay but look at this look how much we've got done already we've got quite a few trees out okay he's gonna focus on this one over here i'm gonna come over here as well and help him remember number three yeah, go over Peter, there and let's start off. moving our guys over here so we can try to contain this a little bit better i'm gonna have him here and number two over here as well so we can kind of spread out together although i have a feeling that they're gonna walk straight through the fire because they seem to be absolutely uh invincible to it so it is what it is Put that fire out dude i'm trying you know i'm working over here Jeez, this walks right in front of you with like that would take your shoes like straight off the pressure of this hose Could you imagine? That no, that would, that would be terrible. They would have fallen immediately Which would be actually a really cool mechanic if that was in the game where you could hit somebody with a hose and they go flying <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. You know, I went to uh, Lowe's and Home Depot the other day and they already have uh, all the Christmas decorations out. I, that's way too early for that. Is, am I wrong about about that? I, I don't think so. But they have all the Christmas decorations out. And we were like, you know what? Might as well look for a Christmas tree because um, we plan on getting a new one. And uh, it's funny because we went to Home Depot and found, like, went to Lowe's first, but then went to Home Depot. And I've got to say, the reason why I'm bringing this up, isn't it so strange? I don't know if you guys feel the same way, but the marketing for Lowe's in the aesthetic there and their their colors and the store is way more inviting than Home Depot with the cops uh, style font and uh, the orange and it just I don't know it just doesn't feel as good as if you go into a Lowe's am I am I wrong I don't, I don't know about that but it, it's so strange to me how that works and i would rather go to a lowe's than a home depot because of that reason they have the same stuff they have their different brands and stuff you know like you have uh pit boss versus traeger and all that and uh i have a pit boss because like i said i i don't go to home depot very often out of the two which one do you guys frequent the most let me know in the comments below i'd be interested to know your uh, thoughts on that as well because i don't know i, I think home depot needs a, a facelift but on the same, uh, on the other side, sorry, uh, they are pretty much established in that and everybody knows the branding by those colors, you know. All right, we have a fire up in this tree over here. They, they're doing a good job, man. They're getting most of that pushed back. I mean, this is much more contained than it was before. Um, I know I keep saying that, but I don't know where these come, these came from right here. Is there another one? Oh, there's another one right here on fire. Oh man, this whole underside right here. It's completely on fire. That's that's what it was. We we must have missed that on the way back. But all right, we're pushing this side here. I'm gonna go off the way all the way to the left here. He's doing this fire. I'm gonna help him out with it. Okay, I'm over here on this side where that one guy was working by himself. He didn't do anything, man. This is like, unless this came back, I don't think it did. But I thought he was taking care of this entire side. He did not at all. So we're over here uh, cleaning up his uh, his mess. Hey, there it is. Hey, maybe that thing is coming back on us a little bit there. I've been fighting this thing pretty good and I didn't move, but that whole flame came back on me and, and got us there. So that's why you heard that. Hey, I'm walking over. 
feels like when they put this update out, they were just like, here you go. Here's a massive fire. Good luck. I'm actually really interested to see how, uh, how long this is actually taken for us to get it all out. Made it back over here to my buddy. I'm going to help him out a little bit, but I got all that left side fire, uh, taken care of. And we pushed this thing back pretty much in a line right now. So we're all, uh, attacking it to here and two over there and i think it's uh it's helping us out quite a bit man i'll tell you what we're gonna drain that entire water reservoir over there <laughs> that whole uh water tower it feels like we're just gonna drain the whole thing because we are using so much water to get these trees down here we go we are uh still going strong here you can see his stream in the bottom right there he's hitting that tree uh on the back side here i'm gonna get the trunk out and he's going to advance forward. All right, we're advancing once again off to the right now that we got all this left side taken care of. And I'm going to help him kind of sweep up to the left this way. And uh, if we work together, man, it, it gets these fires out a lot quicker. Average mission time expired. Yeah, well, what do you expect, man? I, I don't know what they expect from us since I can't get in the bucket. And I tried to get the AI in the bucket. It just... I don't know if the bucket's bugged out or something, but it just, it's not happening. I would hit E and try to get in there over and over again. and would say, nope, nope. You know, something that is missing uh, from this game uh, that is part of firefighting is the investigation work uh, needed to find the cause of the fire and all that. I think if they added that, that'd be really, really cool, you know, to be like, hey, how did this force fire start? Well, we know there's a car that was burning. There were victims on the ground, two of them, uh, or three of them. Was it two? Yeah, two. I, I, I don't remember, but legitimately, it's pretty crazy that, that you just kind of put all these fires out and just go, well, that's it. All right. Well done. And, you know, investigation is, is part of firefighting for sure. We're close enough now. We can see all of our firefighters, two there and us two on the left side. So we're still attacking this thing up the hill. We're so close to being done. All right. The left side is pretty much done. All we have left is this little bit of fire over here. The top of this tree and just below it is where it's at actually right now. So there's the spot right there. Okay, that one's out. Sweet. We're all moving up on this last bit. Debriefing objective complete. We did it. Let's see how long this actually took because it was insane. There we go. You can see everything is put out and mission time slow. 49 minutes to put out that forced fire challenge bonus of 1500 arrival time. Mission time, uh, water used, and distance walk, blah, 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 blah. And there you have it, folks. That is a look at the new update for Firefighter Simulator the Squad and uh, the Bike Hike Quench uh, is what we get. 1,500 XP for. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below, and I'll see you all next time. Take care.